Uh, hi Tyler, how are you doing? Um, well, I'm sort of stuck. Um, yeah, I thought you might be. Hang on, let me give you a hand. Uh. Whew, thanks. What were you doing anyway? I, um, got lost. Lost? Well, I was trying to find the way on that map and I looked everywhere and I couldn't find it. And I got right up close to see it better and I just got a bit tangled. Oh well. <laughs> what were you trying to find the way to anyway? Um, what do you mean? Well, you said you were trying to find the way. W what were you trying to find the way to? No, I was just trying to find the way. To where? No, just the way. You said earlier we were looking at the way and I was trying to find what it was so I knew where it was. Oh, sorry Tyler, I've sort of confused you. This week we're looking at Jesus saying, I am the way. You are? No, and you've made that joke every week in this series. It's getting a bit old. Yeah, well, <laughs> so are you. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, thanks. But no, I mean Jesus said, I am the way. But... He is a bit like a map, only he's not the map to a place, he's the map to life. Knowing Jesus is the way to live life as it's made to be lived, life to the full. So, does that mean being all religious and going to church every Sunday and all of that? Well, no. I mean, if you're a Christian, it's really important to go to church, uh, whichever church you go to, because... That's where you meet with your family. You can support each other. You can keep each other going and, and all of those kind of things. But actually, life to the full just means life knowing Jesus because that's, well, life. So Jesus is like a map showing us the way to life. But the other day I was out driving and... What? I was out driving and you were driving. That's right. But you're not old enough to drive. Dan, if that's your biggest problem with me driving, then I'm worried. Anyway, I was out driving and I told the sat-nav to navigate a shortcut to our house. And well, it didn't really go well. The map lied to me and it said, turn left immediately. And I turned left and well, let's just say the car ended up where cars have no business being. <laughs> um, Tyler, did you just say you turned left immediately? Immediately. But that's not left, that's right. Right. Yes. Ow. Anyway, whichever way you turned, sat-navs do get it wrong sometimes. They don't know about new roads or they don't understand where you're trying to get to. Like the guy who said navigate to the sea and then ended up fishing seaweed out of his glove compartment. But Jesus doesn't just say, I am the way. He also says, I am the truth. What? You are? Tyler. But no. Jesus says, I am the way, so that we can follow him. And Jesus says, I am the truth, so that we can trust him. And remember what he's the way to? Life! Exactly. I am the way, the truth and the life. What, you are? Ah, ah, ah. Okay, sorry. Anyway, so unlike my um, unfortunate car trip, we can follow and trust Jesus to get us where we need to go. You've got it. Well, we'll be looking at another I am saying soon, but until next time, goodbye and God bless. Bye. Just off for a quick drive. See you later. Oh, there's a very big dog in the wing mirror. Better go quickly. Turn left. Turn left. Oh, 
Oh dear. Oh dear. Um, I think I might need some help. Help! Help!